you play Professor Bear. Can you yes. tell me a little bit about that? All right, so Professor Bayer, he is a he is a German professor who teaches the main character, Joe March. Um, and you only see him a few times throughout the show. However, he is a very important character and he goes through some sort of development that I'm not going to spoil anything, but come see it. Um, yeah. He goes through some sort of development that really really finishes off his huge character development throughout the whole show so yeah yeah that sounds amazing and I'm definitely going to see it just to see you <laughs> as Professor well, Bear thank you <laughs> um so tell me like what's your experience been like in the show oh our experience has been so great we've got to work with a guest director Lenny Banavez from New York um, and our music director is Kristen Singer and they are originally Wisconsin natives and they have done professional shows and professional experiences out in New York and out in the real world. So that has been really, really cool to work with them. We got hands-on professional experience and now they're great connections with us to have. But yeah, overall, the show's experience has been really good. We blocked the show pretty fast and now we're into just our running stage and we're teching it. And overall, I think it's gonna be a really good show. And yeah. So. It sounds like you're a pretty seasoned actor. So how long have you been acting? So I've been acting since I was four. My mom threw me into like church theater when I was a kid um, because I had a stutter and she thought that it would fix it. So it did. But um, yeah, I've been acting ever since. I've been doing summer programs at the high school and then into high school. I did it all four years and then I declared it as my major here and I'm hoping to do it after college as well, hopefully. Fingers crossed. <laughs> <laughs> so you're a real genuine theater kid, huh? Yes, I guess you could call <laughs> me the theater kid. <laughs> so what's your favorite show that you've been in? Hmm. I know it's a hard question. It is a very hard question. Um, this show definitely is up there now, but I would say before this, definitely last year, my freshman year, we did a production of A Year with Frog and Toad here and that was really fun to be a part of. We also got to work with a guest director and I just really loved that show. It was our children's show, so we got to interact with all the little kids afterwards. So that was just a super cool experience to be a part of. Do you like children's shows or like do you prefer performing for adults? That just depends. I mean, I, I love performing for kids. I love seeing their face. I, I just love all aspects of theater pretty much and being in either one would make me happy. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, I do, I, do love I do love performing for the kids, so. Yeah, and who doesn't? Right. Who doesn't love to see all those screaming little smiling faces? Right, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> um, so what's your guilty like theater song? Like when you're like by yourself in your room, like what do you listen to? Mm. <laughs> love that question. <laughs> um, definitely off the Dear Evan Hansen, soundtrack waving through a window i practically belt out my vocal cords every time i sing it in the shower or whatever <laughs> <laughs> so yeah i guess that would be my guilty my like guilty pleasure theater song theater song all right well thank you so much for being here i've had such a great time thank talking you. to you we actually have a clip from your show so <laughs> let's watch that right now all right professor do you dance no i do not Today I could. <laughs> <laughs> we should celebrate your success, Miss March. Have you ever been to the Broadway Gardens? Are you asking me to dinner, Professor? No, no. Yes. I should like that. And some days I go to the park and I sit there all afternoon. Some evenings I swear. I can hear a door slam. The house is far too quiet now. That is how I am. Welcome to Marquette Lately. I'm Alex Rivera Grant, your host for this week.